Welcome to the Hanel Modus 600RT wireless speedlight. In this video I'll speak about unboxing the unit and also a brief introduction to its use. The Modus 600RT will be available for Canon, Nikon and Sony versions. The contents of the kits are the same for all models so in this video I'll talk about the Canon version as an example. In the kit we have the Modus 600 speedlight, we have a lithium ion battery to power the unit, a set of user instructions, we also have a charger for the lithium ion battery and it includes mains leads both Euro and UK types. So we'll move on now to speak in more detail about these individual pieces. The Modus 600 is powered using a lithium ion battery. This is 2040 milliampere hour capacity and with it you can get up to 500 full power flashes. With that you'll also get a consistent cycle time of less than two seconds. Ships with a charger for your lithium ion battery. The Modus 600 RT itself comes in a protective case and also ships with a stand. The head has full 360 degree rotation. And we have movement from minus 7 degrees to 90 degrees for bounce flash. It also includes a catch light panel and a built in wide panel. On the side here we have an external sink socket and we have a micro USB socket for firmware upgrades. So now we have the Modus 600RT mounted on the camera. It's being used as a local on-camera speedlight. In this situation, I can set the mode of the speedlight, pressing this button. I can set it from ETTL to manual mode into multi-mode. You can see that in ETTL, you can set flash exposure compensation, flash exposure bracketing, and the sync mode. So that's ETTL operation. If I press mode button again, I am in manual mode. Here I can vary the flash output power. O1 and O2 are covered in a separate video. And I can select high speed sync and rear curtain sync as well. I can also go to multi mode. And in this situation, I can decide the flash output power. I can decide the number of times the flash will fire. And I can decide the rate at which it will fire. So here I have power level, the number of times it will fire, and the rate at which it will fire. Here I've got it set to 1 over 128 power. It's going to fire 10 flashes. It's going to fire them at a rate of 10 flashes per second. So obviously that's going to take roughly one second. I've set the shutter speed to 1.3 seconds on the camera. And you can see it take 10 rapid flashes. This is sometimes referred to as stroboscopic mode. The Modus 600 RT, of course, is for use on camera in manual, ETTL and multi-mode. But it's also part of an integrated family of products from Hanel, which includes the capture range of remote controls. So with this, it's possible, for instance, to use a capture transmitter to remotely trigger the modus. You can also use, as an example, the 
Capture Module Pro, or you can use a Viper TTL, which gives you group control of your off-camera flash guns. So now we've had an introduction to the Modus 600RT wireless speedlight. We've seen how it can be used on camera in manual, ETTL and multi-modes. And we've also seen briefly how it can be used off camera as part of more complex lighting setups. Check out some of the other videos in this series for more details on how to get the best from your Hanel Modus 600RT. Mm -hmm.